Cody McConnell here. Now, uh, originally for this video, I was actually planning it as a live stream. However, due to my live stream issues that I have over my internet, um, it could not happen as a live stream. But it can happen. At, it can still happen as a separate video. So this is what this video is. It's basically a makeup for the live stream. But today is um, a huge day for all of us Nintendo fans. As you can see, the Nintendo Direct is about to air in four minutes from the time I'm recording this video. Um, so even though I won't have the live interaction with you guys, um, I'm still really looking forward to reacting to this Nintendo Direct um, because they have new stuff coming. Um, in detail for Fire Emblem Three Houses, and it came in just roughly a month after um, the delay announcement of Metroid Prime 4, which is something that we won't see in probably for quite some time. Um, but I'm still really glad that we still got an internal direct to showcase all the new stuff that are coming, like Fire Emblem Three Houses, as it states. Um, but hopefully, we get some new stuff for Yoshi's Crafted World. Um, maybe more on Luigi's Mansion 3 if there's any chance, um, or, and Animal Crossing as well, or possibly some, I know this is kind of controversial when it comes to Switch, but probably, a, like, one or two Wii U ports, um, so, that's what I'm looking forward to, hopefully you guys are excited as well, the Direct is about to start within three minutes, and so instead of, um, just seeing me wait here, I'm just gonna fast forward to when Nintendo Direct starts. So, whew. oh, it's starting. Okay, all right, it's starting. Let's do this. Hopefully, my volume is good. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it is. All right. Nowhere to bring Mario Maker to the Switch. This looks like Mario Maker. No way. Yes. Oh, right away, we get a game that we wanted to see on the Switch. I don't think this is a sequel. I think this is just a port. If it's a sequel, I will be happy as well. But, but we get to see Mario Maker on the Switch. Yes! Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm happy for this. It is a sequel! What? It's a sequel! Oh my goodness, they're adding new- Oh my god, they're adding new elements. Yo! It's even better than a port. What? I did not just see a bird. Oh, the interface is like- Well, they're adding a 3D world? Wait a minute. There's no way. Oh, I was about to say, they actually added like- The actual 3D gameplay that would have killed it. But no, no, no. It's just the 2D aspects of 3D world, but still, I'm still happy. But this is amazing. I'm, I'm down for this. I'm happy that this exists. Oh, Luigi's involved too, which means I think there's some co-op. <gasps> June? Is that soon? Oh my god. Hi, everyone. Oh my god. I'm Yoshiaki Koizumi, and I'll be your guide oh. for today's Nintendo Direct. Man, if I was live streaming this, I would. Pretty sure every one of you will be going insane. You just got your first look at the brand new sequel to Super Mario Maker. Oh my god. Which we're, of course, calling Super Mario Maker 2. Oh my god. There will be brand new features. And many new elements are in development as we speak. They're adding a Super Mario so 3D world element, but it's not an actual 3D, but it's in 2D. But still. All right. Next, let's cover today's Nintendo Switch headlines. One. That's one way to start off a direct. For the first time in 10 oh, years. Oh, yeah. This is something that they announced in the uh, Game Ultimate Awards. Alliance series returns with a new four yo, Super Mario RPG Maker 2. All new original story. Assemble your ultimate dream team oh from a huge cast of Marvel superheroes, from the Guardians of the Galaxy to the Avengers, Defenders, X-Men, and more, to stop Thanos and the Black Order from unleashing cosmic Yeah, this chaos. is basically based on. You can play together in TV world. mode locally on up to four systems or online yeah, it would still glad that we still have some sort of marvel game on the switch heroic camera and speaking of heroic, i'm sorry if i'm not excited higher, for this further, game super mario maker marvel 2 cosmic protector Captain Yo. marvel wield her power against those that will oh. do harm to the universe the last As time it was luigi's mansion 3 and now we have super mario maker 2. Fly. let's see what else sequels that we probably might be getting today 
In addition to basic attacks and skills, each hero has an alliance extreme attack, mm -hmm. their most powerful move. When Damn. you join forces with friends, yeah, I'm not that on line, big on Marvel, so I'm, to unprecedented levels, I'm and sorry, but I know a lot of people hero are. Skills into it's just that it's not my type of uh, your most powerful attack can even be combined into Pokemon. an ultimate alliance extreme attack. The team up possibilities will be off the charts when Marvel Ultimate Alliance 3 the summer, Black okay. Order launches exclusively on Nintendo Switch this summer. All right. Welcome hey, back, Box, Box Boy's back. Get ready to unload Yo, some this is amazing. Have fun doing it. The critically acclaimed puzzle series Box Boy. Yeah, I enjoyed these games Nintendo on the Switch 3DS, so I'm really glad I this get to enjoy it on the Switch. This brand new game is tightly packed with tons of content, including brand new puzzles and new features. We fit something um, okay. else. Okay, I never too. played. Only played the first one. Co-op. This time, two players can box it up that's together. Real. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. On the oh, box thanks, planet, Logitech. You must work Why as a team, solve puzzles, <laughs> and beat those stages. After completing the story, you can access a whole separate adventure yeah. starring Cutie, the tall one. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah, I never played the rest of the Box Boy games, so I'm not sure about the other characters. In but... all, there are 270 stages to beat. That's the highest in the series to date. Well, I'm really glad Use that um, boxes to think Box Boy and Super Mario Maker 2 are heroes to the existing goal. on the Switch now. Box Boy and Box Girl oh, okay. will That's unload on Nintendo Switch April 26th. April 26th, okay. The Ultimate Spring Ooh. Update. This is for Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. Yeah, I'm kind of expecting not another character reveal. Super Smash Bros. Ultimate is about to version spring 3. forward with the version 3.0 update right. this spring. Let's see what this spring update What is. are we adding, you ask? Hmm. You'll just have to wait to find out. What? Remember, Joker is a part of Challenger Pack 1. Oh, wait. He's secretly been preparing for battle. Is and he his actually moment part of spring will finally come before the end of April. In other Ooh. words, this year, springtime is the time to smash. And don't forget, new Super Smash okay, Bros. series two, Amiibo figures are leaked, on the way too. So... Yeah, oh, so uh, Squirtle and Ivysaur have their own stubborn amiibo, okay. All right. There's even more to explore in Captain Toad Treasure Tracker. Wait a minute, is there a new game? It's never too late oh. for a journey through the maze-like I was about to say, are Captain you making Toad a new Captain Toad, Toad game already? In fact, we have two new announcements for the Nintendo Switch version. Are you serious? After a new update, all courses will support two-player co-op. Oh, Maybe two Captain cool. Toad won't be so nervous with someone at his side. Two heads are better than one, oh. and an extra set of hands goes a long way. This free update will be available oh, later today. Oh, that's Odyssey levels. And yeah, having got some that paid downloadable content is coming. Wait, what? We're adding in 18 what? new challenges that'll see you traveling to five new courses. What? From sunken ships to a kingdom of sweets. They should just make a new sequel. New objectives in existing they should courses. just be a new sequel. Uh, that's fine, I guess. Hey, but I'm so glad that you're still supporting Captain, Captain Toad. Captain Toad and Toadette must obtain the shining crowd in each course, all of which can be played alone Whoa. or with a second player. Whoa. Captain Toad Treasure Tracker special, special episode. episode will be available Ooh. for purchase I think I'll be as purchasing soon as, that immediately. well, later today, giving okay. you early access to one of the courses. Get one course immediately. The rest of the content will launch on March 14th. Oh, so it's actually coming out if soon. If you don't have the game yet, look out for a digital bundle available the game. I want to cover on Nintendo those Shop before, later today. Um, it contains the full game and gives you or access to later today you probably might see a gameplay um, video from me so once it's available you get double content from me today if anything steal yourself for old school action Ooh, in an all new gothic castle i don't know if this the is side scrolling action of yore shall rise oh, once the... more in bloodstained ritual of the night and so yeah this is the one that has not come on yet Miriam, the bloodstain the alchemist's curse must use her unwanted gifts yeah and to this slay is what the konami by the curse this is original host basically Jeep. because konami doesn't care about all the Castlevania fans, and they're not powers, making any more Castlevania you can steal games. The abilities of enemies. Ben so yeah, F U two Konami. And You've been about doing Jingle's a lot of at stuff lately. Speed. Here, the laws of reality. I'm and just glad they added Simon and Richter in Smash Ultimate. The castle, but a treasure they need to make more on Castlevania and games. Tasks, and small touches flesh out the campaign. Your body hmm. is covered with weird decorations. Beyond the main story. You can wow. dig deep into character customization. Your customization affects the dialogue. Stop the fall of man at the hands of demons, and don't be afraid to show them your dark side. Bloodstained Ritual of the Night emerges okay. from the shadows this summer. Yeah, I'm still kind of waiting more bloodstained. The time has come to build a new world. Is this Dragon and take Quest on Builders? The children of Hargon. 
Yo, try and crossbow this. Island. You'll yeah, ally like yourself with the mysterious Malrock. Kind of looks so good. your world from monstrous forces. Yeah, it kind of looks like it's more of a build and fight Listen alongside Zane, you in the story mode. Or unite with three right. other builders to create your own island in local co-op. So I'm pretty sure after this, because there's no other headlines, well, after, craft objects and tools. like after this one, and I'm pretty sure it's going to be on fire on one of three houses. You can imagine. Oh my. I can dash. He's half naked. Play I did not just see that. Explore underwater. I'm just going to pretend that. all over the new retro-inspired map. If you own the previous game on the Nintendo Switch system, yeah, it's basically uh, Dragon Quest Minecraft and the Dragon Lord's Throne. Right. July 12th. Okay. The Dragon Quest Builders 2 launches on Nintendo oh. Switch July 12th. Hopefully we get. There are more Nintendo Switch okay. headlines to come, but first, Fire a Blum word from Mr. Koizumi. Well, how's it looking? Fire 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 we have a new announcement for that classic RPG series. Oh, Fire Please Fire take a look. It's Fire Emblem Three Houses. There are RPGs, and then there's Dragon Quest, the series that defined the genre, and the it's latest being localized. is charging onto Nintendo Switch in full force, pairing the series' beloved style and perfectly it's balanced actually being localized. with the most impressive scope and elaborate story in series history. I mean, we know the PS4 one, version was coming, but this is our first time no hearing about the Switch version of America. So, I'm glad the Dragon Quest Eleven is coming. Says will succeed the last hero and protect the world from a terrible land. In an odd twist of fate, the boy's royal birthright is snatched okay. from him. I'm glad this, this is coming to America. On the day he becomes an adult, he finally discovers his true heritage and the powers that make him the luminary. When he goes to the king of the largest kingdom Wait, which, for guidance, is this 10 or 11? he is dubbed Darkspawn. So he begins ten has the perilous journey of a hunting hero the and the ragtag band of adventurers who will join him on his quest to set things right. Hmm. Together they'll explore the towns and terrain of the sprawling this is, detailed like, land. I thought it was just going to be Fire Emblem Three Houses next. No. Monsters roam dragon, free of random It's a giant quest. I'm not sure if this is 10 or 11. I want to say 11 though because in turn -based battles, I think 10 would be already when too to late. Attack, when to heal, when to use magic, and when to switch your party member's orders. As you do, you'll earn skill points which can be used to teach party members attacks, right. spells, and improve their abilities. Well, you can Quest also is collect materials so you can forge weapons, armor, and accessories. So, um, Looking I would get item, into it. Then help people out in side quests. Or try your uh, hand I'll be really happy if Square actually not Kingdom Hearts 3 on the Switch. To be honest. Andrea is full of surprises like these, and this time, the hmm. player has the power to choose on the fly between the land's gorgeous HD vistas and the 2D 16-bit glory oh, of wow. all. This is also the first version of the game with hmm. fully orchestrated field and battle tunes. If you want, you can change between the original sound and the new one whenever you want. Oh, wow. And you can also okay. experience the journey with English or Japanese audio. Yeah, but is it 11? I think it is 11. Oh, yeah, I think 10 is a little too late. So I'm pretty sure this is Dragon Quest 11. Yeah, but it is. It does look like a really fun game. Dragon Quest is a beloved series, so um, if anything, I'll probably might get into it. I say that for a bunch of games, and I don't end up getting into it. <laughs> First-time players and veterans should also look forward to new stories. Each uh. sees one of the main cast members stepping into the spotlight, shedding new light on hidden truths. This hero's adventure yeah, is it's truly 11. 11 S. Up. Dragon Quest XI. This fall, S echoes I'm glad it's coming. Age, it's actually coming to the Switch edition. this year. Launching in exclusively America. on Nintendo Switch this fall. Alright. While we just announced the addition of these new stories, there will be more new information to share in the future. Alright. Please look forward to learning more. Are you more headlines or far on For now, let's continue with more Nintendo Switch headlines. More headlines, okay. Let's see. A Disney Tsum Tsum game oh, like you've never seen before. Game. 
these stuffed Disney toys took the world by storm, and now they're ready for an after-hours party at the toy store in Disney Tsum Tsum Festival. Yeah, I think I've seen like an arcade. Play with your friends uh, and family in a Zoom wide Zoom variety focus. of competitive and cooperative games this that kind support of looks, up to four yeah, players. Okay. It's like a, a standard party game. You can play online as well with players from around the world. Yeah, this would be an interesting game to play though. And you can't mention Disney Tsum Tsum without talking puzzles. Of course. Connect matching Tsum Tsum to clear them and set a high score. This, are, this portion is already the on level, so it makes sense on the Switch for local and screen. online competitive matches. But Disney yeah, Tsum I don't think that mode will be available our hearts on in 2019. Email, so yeah. <laughs> We're picking up a distress call uh, in the Starling. Atlas Star System. But this That's time, one game I get to play, but I'm friendly. pretty sure I'm gonna get the digital fact, version because it's none other than paid. Star Wolf's infamous lieutenants, oh. Andrew Oikini, Pigma Dengar, and the Great Leon. Now Peppy, Falco, and Slippy have no choice but to hunt them down, like the animals so they are. In a challenging new series of missions, you can only find in the spring update of Starlink Battle for Atlas. Every member of the Star Fox team has their own special pilot ability and say, skill tree. Plus, each pilot Fox can take and, on uh, any of the new missions Wolf. and also Fox's missions from the base game. It's yeah. time for a game of seek and destroy, but don't expect Wolf to play fair. Look forward to news on the rest of the additional content, Ooh, such as starship cool. races and faction missions, Ooh, so you're ready when the Star Fox team joins the Starlink be, uh, Battle for Atlas oh, update actually. this April. Alright, let's see what else we have. A heartfelt fantasy adventure crops up once again. Hmm. Another season, another reason to wield weapons Wait, and this? spells against monsters. Good morning. It is about to be fall. Interact with townsfolk daily. Grow vegetables and fruits at the Wait, farm. What game is this? Cook some fish. You never show what game this is. Cook up a storm. Like the name of it. Or even raise monsters. This fantastical circle of life will keep you coming back for more in Room Factory, Factory 4, 4 Special, Four. fully okay, remastered that's for Nintendo the reason Switch. Why I have not heard about this game nor Battle the series. Battle alongside townsfolk, and before okay. long, you may become more than just friends. I'm pretty sure it's also beloved, knowing that there's four games. See what the heart-pounding newlywed life has in store for you, exclusively in this new version of the game. Alright. Rune Factory 4 Special will be ripe yeah, for the so playing Japanese. later this year. Hmm. And... And what? We can Rune finally Factory confirm 5. that Rune Factory 5 is in development. Look oh, wow. forward to more info in the future. So there is a fifth game coming for the series, okay. Soon, a time will come to slay monsters and rescue lost souls. Before those souls become hmm. monsters. In this action RPG from the developers of I Am Setsuna and Lost Sphere. Oh, okay. Step this into is a realm game. built so upon this the tenets must of be, reincarnation. Um, its people leave repressed lives, RPG. forbidden to mourn the loss of loved ones. To uphold these tenets, Kagachi must travel between the living world and the wow. beyond to okay. rescue lost souls from a terrible fate, becoming monsters. Ooh. When battling these creatures, yeah, the many of these games I have not heard of can manifest so. within you. I'm glad that you they're being powers. brought into a new generation of Nintendo gamers. So you must choose so. the right soul for the situation at hand. In this deep single-player campaign, mm. there will be many battles. You will fight, and you will become stronger. Those who fall to grief are lost, and the lost don't reincarnate. Wow. The very foundations of reincarnation will begin to crumble when Oninaki Basically, launches like in summer 2019. A straight up permadeath. Cars, robots, okay, and Yoshi's let's see what's new for Yoshi's crap. Crafted World. You know what that means? Yoshi's Crafted World is This is a game I actually am looking forward this to. Time, I love like Yoshi's. I like the many facets of these crafty courses on display. Well, As Yoshi, yeah. you'll go rafting. Yeah, I can tell they're using Race Unreal Engine for it because that water looks so detailed. <laughs> the sky on a plane. Nice shot, Yoshi. Hey, that yeah, this is like the first Nintendo game to use Unreal Engine. Even at this scale, you'll have some challenging bosses oh, wow. to wrangle. Dang. Using in-game coins you've racked up, you can collect crafted costumes. Really? Let's see if we get crafted Where costumes through Amiibo, because I wouldn't be surprised. protection from enemies. Oh, wow. Look at these costumes. There are more than 180 of these costumes. 
and some of them can huh. be tricky to get your hands on. Oh, the level. <laughs> Later today, we'll release a demo. <gasps> let you play through the first course. I have a bunch of gameplay videos coming out then today. Yoshi's Crafted World game will finally hatch on March Looks like 29. I have a bunch of um We have more Nintendo Switch today. headlines coming up, but first, another update from Mr. Koizumi. Okay, which game is this? How's it going so far? Next, we have a follow-up on the latest installment in one of our long-running series. Okay. Fire Emblem Three Houses. Finally, okay. Please, have a look. I was about to say, you don't throw another curveball thinking that it is Fire Emblem um, Three Houses. But it is. Is that Tiki? How come that looks like Tiki? Oh my. What could have brought you here? Okay, that logo, that logo is better <laughs> than how they revealed at E3. That logo was so bland. The this logo of Fogin, is nice. Said to be protected by a revered goddess, has existed since time mm. immemorial. Three ruling yeah, powers. Yeah, I really love Fire Emblem nowadays. Awakening. Fates. In the south lies a region long held I never by more the, than the one thousand year old Echo dynasty, so. the Adrestian Empire. I'm, I'm really looking Beyond forward to its three borders, houses. to the frigid north. Is the home of the Holy Kingdom of Fargus, ruled by the oh. royal family and its knights. To the east, a league of nobles that heeds no king nor emperor rules what is called the Leicester Alliance. Huh. Once consumed by a tempest of war and turmoil, Fodlan and these three mighty powers now exist in relative harmony. Okay. In the Fire Emblem Three Houses game, you are the hero the world needs. Wow. You start out as a mercenary traveling with a group led by your father, Geralt. After an unexpected incident reveals an unknown power hidden within, you'll travel to Garrick Mock Monastery, where you'll receive an offer to teach at the Officer's Academy. Around that same time, you alone begin to see a mysterious girl named Sothis, who appears She looks like Tiki. That's what I kind of like assume because of the green hair and the face. The monastery and the three houses. All right. Garrig Mock Monastery lies at the center of three large territories. Oh. It is the home base the of the Church houses. of Saros, the main religion of Fodlan, as well as the Knights of hmm. Saros. Not only does the church serve to maintain order in Fodlan, its monastery also houses the Officers' Academy. Those who train there will go on to shoulder the future of Fodlan. The Officers' Academy is comprised of three okay. houses. The Black Eagles is for students from the Adrestian Empire, including the house leader and future emperor, Edelgard. The Blue Lions boasts Prince Dimitri of the Holy Kingdom of Fargus as its house leader. This house is for students from his kingdom. The Golden Lions, Deer the Golden is for Deer. students from the Leicester Alliance. Their house leader is Claude, who is the heir of the noble family that leads the Alliance. In the Arisons Empire. As a professor, you will lead the students of one of these houses and instruct them. In addition to the house leaders, there are many other students to meet, each with their own unique personalities and skills. Which house will you choose? Oh, this guy... Similar to fates in a way. Students are expected to travel to various lands, sometimes with the mm. Knights of Saros themselves, and gain real battle experience, including everything from defeating bandits to suppressing rebellions. These may be class assignments, but the stakes in each battle are very real. Whether your students live or die will depend on your leadership. Strategize they as the have... battle progresses to Is claim this just victory. regular sound to permadeath now? At the Officer's Academy, Burn. your students will work diligently each day so that they may wield a variety of weapons. Dang. Master the study of magic. And acquire special skills such as horsemanship. You have been entrusted with their future, and it's up so to you to guide each of them and help them so hone their abilities. Through combat experience a and study, house you can help your students skills. reach their full potential. Oh my. 
Your students can also interact with each other at the academy, and by doing so, their bonds will strengthen, and they'll be able to better support each other on the battlefield. Yeah, this is still an interesting take. Three territories, three houses, wow. your very own journey. Which had to Fire go Fire Emblem Three Houses will release on July 26th. Ooh, this summer's gonna be interesting. And there is a special edition. Oh, great. <laughs> so, how does it look? Originally, we announced that Fire Emblem Three Houses would release this spring, but more development time will be necessary. Oh yeah, so the new they release date is July 26th. Hey, but at least we have a date. We'll have to ask you to wait a little longer, but we hope you'll look forward yeah, to the next generation of Fire Emblem it, all the same. At least it's still being released this year. We actually have a confirmed time for some date. more Nintendo Switch headlines. And then, by another unexpected reveal that would make us be in our In his next entry of this iconic series, Tetris? the last player standing wins. That looked like a Tetris block. 99 players. But only one reigns supreme. This is... Tetris 99. It was Tetris! Yes! The iconic puzzle game arrives with an online experience like no other. I... I... Uh... I think Triforce, Nintendo Switch um, online Triforce Johnson battle for is excited right now. Is free to he loves game. Tetris. Um, if you guys have not known Triforce, he's basically garbage. one of the Attack original Nintendo players who needed line for so many survivor. Nintendo franchises. I mean, not franchises. Consoles. Nintendo but Switch online members Tetris 99 looks like interesting, fight. even though it uses the Tetris online service. Tetris 99 will be available for paid. download later <gasps> today. Look forward to battling it out in upcoming online events. Why is it that... Um... Prepare to kill, to survive, make or so die many gameplay videos dead this by week. daylight. Imagine this. You're alone. Dead by daylight. Struck by oh. fear. Struggling to survive. And then you meet another survivor. But it's too late. The killer is a you. The, um, now run. Fire emblem special edition. Hide. For your houses. Scavenge for items. Open the gates. Now that and looks escape nice. with your life. I probably might get take that. on the role of the killer to make the so-called survivors your next victims. Whoa! Terrifying? Ooh. Oh yes. Satisfying? Just you wait. With loads of maps, Dang. characters, and cosmetics to earn, you'll experience a deep progression system while you're on the hunt or being hunted. <laughs> Discover the true meaning Dead of horror daylight. when Dead by Daylight creeps up on Nintendo Switch this fall. Horror games are not my game, so this dog will ruin your day. Rude. Oh my goodness. It's this game. I forgot what the name of this game was. Delta Room. So yeah, this Undertale type game is gonna be interesting. are basically blocking the screen. There aren't actually that many dogs in the game. Oh, it's actually coming up. Oh! For free! This chapter's free. Alright, I'm now I'm for in. a message from the producer. Oh, finally. The futuristic mech Damon X Machina is Damon one that I am also excited to see too. Hello, we get everyone. Damon. I'm Kinichiro Tsukura, producer of Damon X Machina, and I have some news for you. Right. Later today, they'll be releasing a demo called Damon X Machina what? Mission <laughs> on Nintendo eShop for a limited time. Oh, hey, like... The game is still in development, but in the demo you can battle through four different missions while exploring wow. the basic controls and customizations of your personal mech known as an arsenal. Uh, okay. You can also experience a like, boss battle in the final mission, I've, so please try it I out. I can try... I... okay. Since all these demos are coming out today... Demo, 
We'd like to hear your feedback. Like, I want to record the demos today. A short online survey However, by sending an email invite to some players who try out prototype missions. If you weren't selected for the survey, we also welcome your feedback via social media. We okay. appreciate your feedback yeah. and hope to make this but game like, the best it can be. Since all these demos are coming out today, we I'll record all these, these demos today, but you probably may so not see them until the next week. Nintendo of America Twitter account, my computer so you can stay up to date on the latest information. Uh, does not have a fan. I need to fix that, so... Oh, this is so broken. Yeah, but I need to fix my account on my computer in order to get videos working again. So please stay tuned. So I'm just kind of fortunate to record this video and have it out. Realistic Racing is headed for Nintendo Switch. Realistic Racing? What the heck? Grid Autosport comes fully loaded oh, with a mix okay. of high-speed thrills, believable handling, and a okay. difficulty level that scales to Simulation your skills. Racers, um, spec Forza. You'll feel like a pro I racer play? as you master the um, world's fastest cars to win motorsports for me, most I, exhilarating races. I prefer, like, From the, the prestigious circuit of Spa Francochon like to the narrow city Mario streets Kart. of Barcelona. I'm hoping F-Zero comes is on the with 100 cars, Nintendo did say that they have a game that some fans said they would have. Like motion controls and like, custom controls. I don't think they will refer to players Super Mario Maker 2. Players or locally, and two um, players can race split screen on a single system. Hopefully by the end of this from street yeah. racing to demolition um, derby. When Grid Autosport speeds on Nintendo Switch in summer 2019. Okay. Enter the Viking Age to experience Hellblade. Senua's journey again, or for the very first Ooh. time. Okay. Created in collaboration with neuroscientists and people who experience psychosis, Hellblade pulls players deep into the mind of Senua. This broken Celtic warrior will embark on a haunting vision quest okay. through Viking hell to yeah, fight this for game the has soul been out for quite some time, I believe. Hellblade has won multiple awards, including BAFTAs for performance, audio and artistic achievement, British Game and That's Game Beyond Entertainment. Right. Find out why when Hellblade Senua's so, Sacrifice releases on Nintendo okay. Switch this spring. Yeah, Nintendo's been getting a lot of The Nintendo Switch lineup just keeps getting stronger. Okay. Yeah, Mortal Nerf, Kombat so. 11 proves yep. the saga 25 years This one was a complete odd that I did not expect coming on the all Switch. new custom character variations, awesome. plus new characters what? and I'm returning really veterans coming to the Switch. the fight. <laughs> In a fresh new adventure, <gasps> Unravel 2 sees players take yes! control of two I, adorable This was a game from last year that I wanted to see on the Switch. Both on your own in single player. But I'm glad it's coming on now. In local co-op for some puzzling platforming fun. Thank you, Unravel EA, 2 for actually being Nintendo good Switch for Switch, to Switch fans for once. For the first time on Nintendo oh, Switch, this one was true. Assassin's Creed 3 Remastered with revamped gameplay and this features. This one was true. Like motion aiming this one got and leaked. Set in the American Revolution. Explore one of the most iconic eras in history. I didn't as you think fight for freedom this would come. Independence and usher in the How rise of the nation. How will you bring the rest of the Assassin's All Creed games that were content, out? Plus the entire recently. standalone game, Assassin's like Creed three? Liberation Remastered, will be included when they launch together on May 21st. Yeah, I heard that three wasn't Final that Fantasy good. fans, oh. better open your calendars. We're excited to announce when? that Final Fantasy VII will find its new home on Nintendo Switch March 26th. That I'll play though. <laughs> we can also announce that Chocobo's Mystery Dungeon Everybody will release <laughs> on March 20th. Well. We're pleased to announce that Final Fantasy IX will journey onto Nintendo Switch later <gasps> today. What? Once a classic. How do you release classic. Final Fantasy IX before seven or ten Nintendo or ten two? Like how does that work, Square? How's everything looking? Well, we have a bit more to share in this Nintendo Direct. Please stay with us until the end. Another reveal. Let's take a look, shall we? Another reveal. Oh my god. Oh my god, they did this last time. What's this? What's this? game this is
bank. How foolish. You people are leading all of humanity straight to damnation. Straight to damnation? You're the terrorist here! You don't understand. My heart goes out to you too. All because of how you were born. What Don't game is this, though? I'm confused. Like, if it's from a popular series, I'm gonna, to I'm gonna be mad at myself. Today has been most revelatory. Finally, we're ready for the final stage. What the hell are they? Why, Why did you make them? Oh, really just for Plano. Okay. Astro Chain. Okay. August 30th. Well, yeah, this is a brand new series from Plano. Nice, nice. What you just witnessed is Astral Chain, a brand new action game in development at Platinum Games. Okay. It looked like two characters were fighting together during battle. I thought this would be the last game announcement. I hope you're excited to learn more about how combat will play out in this game. Mm. Please Looks stay interesting. Tuned. And speaking of Platinum Games, I'm sure you're very curious about Bayonetta 3. Bayonetta 3. Rest assured, the developers of Bayonetta 3 are hard at work, oh. and I hope you're looking forward to learning more. Our next title will be the last announcement of the day. Please, really? check it out. What is this? Okay, what's this? What's this? Huh. No way it's a brand new Zelda game. No way. No way it's a brand new Zelda game. Are you serious? It's a 2D Zelda game. Oh my god. It's basically a 3D remake of Link's Awakening. Okay. That drew me off for a second, but... But hey, at least we get another Zelda game. Yeah, it's filled with... Yeah, most of the recent... So the games have been oh well. Yeah, I knew adding Mario elements was in Zelda was, uh, was quite unintentional, but still. It's a Link's Awakening remake. I don't think this is a brand new Link's Awakening, like a sequel, but it's a remake. So, what did you think? At long last, 1993's Game Boy Classic, yeah, the Legend of Zelda it's a remake. Link's Awakening will find new life on Nintendo Switch. Wow. After 26 years, it has been reborn as a new experience. Oh, and we'll have more like a link between future. worlds. Okay, so this is going to be like a link between Please worlds. Please look forward to its release. We're a brand new That's game, all but today is Nintendo style. Direct. Thank you so much for watching. Are you sure, though? You guys have been known for pulling oddball announcements. Ah, that's it. All right, all right, all right. Yeah, it's over. All right. So, today's Nintendo Direct was really, really interesting. Um, we got a bunch of games with demos out today. Um, Captain Toad Treasure Tracker DLC, the first level was out today. Uh, but the biggest announcements, uh, The Link's Awakening, um, I would want, I would still want to say remake, but it's not. It's basically a new game set in that same world style. Um, but the biggest one is definitely what they showed first, and that was Super Mario Maker 2. Um, I love the new assets. I love the new um, elements. Um, once I saw the 3D World logo, I was like thinking, wait, they're adding elements from 3D World. Is it actually 3D? It's not in a way. It's basically like the 2D aspects. But that's still pretty cool. Um, yeah, I'm really, really excited. Excited to see all these new games being announced. Um, for all the gameplay videos of the demos that have that are coming out today, um, I w would want to record them this week. Um, 
but you probably will not see them until possibly this weekend or sometime next week. The reason for this is that my computer has having fan issues. And right now, as I'm recording this video on my PC, there is no um, fan for my actual CPU. So trying to render this video is going to be tough. Um, but once that PC fan gets um, fixed, um, it is coming sometime next week, then I'm going to be back into making full-blown YouTube content. So, yeah. Thank you for watching this. And I will see you all sometime soon. Possibly this by the end of this week or next week. Um, just stay tuned to my social media, um, which I'll be saying pretty shortly. Peace. Thanks for watching. Make sure you like this video and also subscribe to my channel and click on the notification bell to get more videos like this. Also, follow me on Twitter, Instagram, Hashtiff, and join my Discord server. Thank you again, and I'll see you next time.